What's up, guys, and welcome back to the Bornwood Youth Academy Career Mode, episode number five. It's the start of a new season, so I'm going to go over a couple changes. First of all, new players coming in. Ayadama was um Youth Academy. I didn't get a single free agent because I don't feel like it. But Ayadama, six foot three striker from Gabon. I can promise you he's not Aubameyang's reach, and I signed him up. This guy from San Marino, Guadetti. And who else? Uh, these two. Ismail Leo Elov, 55 overall, he came in, and 55 overall Patterson, I'll show the nations too. Bahamas, Azerbaijan, and San Marino. And this is how the team's looking overall wise. I mean, the overall's going up kind of nicely now, but I'm going to play him for the first game because he's kind of tall, he can kind of head the ball. So let's go ahead and look at the other changes now. I'm just not even going to cut, we're going right over here. Um, I'm gonna go give them. I give them each four star experience because I want more players. I don't really care if they're um if they're better players. I just want more players. Um, so that's why I gave them all up. Bangladesh, New Caledonia, New Caledonia, yeah, and Greenland. You might ask why am I doing Greenland and stuff? Well, the first three were already gone, but everyone here and below has left the club. You might be asking why. Hamdan went to that team. None of these players actually had it played for the team. He played literally zero times. The only player, there are any players I'm actually sad that left. Maybe Alam, but that's it. I don't really care anyone else left. So I'll give you a quick scroll through again about who, what, where, and they each have potentials from 80 to 92. So. We'll see how they grow, and hopefully they go to be one of some of the best players in the world. Also, I didn't just let go of everybody. I loaned a couple players out. Um, Sechaba Kobo got loaned out from Lesotho, Les Lesotho to Portland Timbers. Juan Carlos Mora got loaned out to Guatemala. Y Yanitha Carderante got loaned out to Sri Lanka. Solomon Jones, got a I don't know why I'm saying um, the nations. The Trinidad um, Spaco striker Solomon Jones got loaned out. Gabriel Capitani, the Solomon Islands, who was loaned out last season, gets loaned out again. Gabriel Talapapa gets loaned out again. Not again. He gets loaned out because I feel like he has a funny name. He'd be really good. Patrick Soguani gets loaned out. He went down in overall because they changed it from right, right wing back to right back. And Mark Cortez gets loaned out because we have a lot, a lot of center backs right now. One, two, three, four, five. I think we can only do a four with two starters and two backups. So I think the last thing to show is the kits. Oh, yeah, I gave the new striker a sick haircut. We got a new sponsor, Win, which I thought would be really cool. And here's the home kit. Looking all right. And there's the away kit. I forgot. I also have to show the goalkeeper kit, so I'm going over there now. You can kind of see it right there, but it have the long sleeves. I don't know how to do that. There is the goalkeeper kit. Very, just nothing on it, plain, kind of not very clean, actually. It's just a goalkeeper kit. Also sponsored by Buen, but it's light blue. Let's go ahead and play the first game now of this new season, though. All right, so our first game is against Bradford City. Are you kidding me? Looks like our jerseys kind of conflict once again. Every time we play them, our jerseys conflict. So, that's no good. Of course. Why would Tedeschi guard the back post? It was like he was wide open and Tedeschi was guarding nobody. That's a good save by Hussein. My defense is not up to par. Still, I don't know how. Now they're gonna take the corner. It's a right to the into the box. Oh, of course they do. That was a great save. And my defense, no one can ever win a header on this team except for El Mahal. That's just how it is. Okay. Tadesi. 
He can shoot. What was that shot? There's no shot someone 60 overall should be hitting shots like that. I get the ball. That's halftime. The problem is they just sweat it across. And I have to um, be wary for that because my defense doesn't drop back. And I can't just do drop back because that's not how the tactics work. So I don't know what it is, honestly. All right. I switched mock time and Tedeschi. So now Tedeschi's playing um, CDM and mock time's playing left back. And I also put in Moretti in for his player debut at Cam in from Watalan. Of course. Okay. That shot was super easy to save. I'm not even going to be like, oh, they shouldn't have got that shot off. That shot was super easy. And uh, Hussein lets it in. That's his first mistake of the game. Play through. And he catches up with ease. Oh. The finish. Yes. And his debut. Our new striker, Ayodama, gets his first goal for the club. I mean, he's been playing pretty atrocious, but the keeper gives the ball away. And we just went it across to him, wide open in the middle. Well, he kind of has to finish. Now they say we take him off for Hughes. Kind of agree. I mean, good finish, though. So he's capable of finishing is what I see from that. Come on, keep. Good save. Pick it up. Really good stuff. Foul. No foul. And he turns around. And just tackles him from behind. We're not even talking about a foul at this point. We're talking about a red card worthy challenge. It's another good save. We still have a chance, I guess, to get a second one back. No, they, caught, they blow a whistle. For them, they wouldn't, but for us, they do. That's fun. Um, so, yeah. So, I guess new team, or new season, new kits. Teams are better, but I guess it's going to be the same team. Play the match has to go Hussein. He did outstanding. The defense just let him down. El Mahel had a really good game, but that's what it is. Also, uh, someone's getting a downgrade. And I can promise you, I know who it is. All right, so now we have a game to simulate against Oxford because it's an EFL cap, and I'm never going to play a game in here. Um, and what I notice is we have a couple good players that we can, that can get rotated in. About one, two, three, four, five, about six players, or even more. Looking at it, we lose two to zero, but it doesn't matter. We have a good, uh, a solid backup team now. All right. We're going to simulate this game against Stevenage. Because I cannot care less to play against them. In the EFL League 2. And we get a 2-2 draw. With a Babana scoring with both. We did get kind of lucky it looks like. Um, team played good. Who didn't? El Mahal. That's interesting right there. Alright. We're going to play this game against Rochdale. And I sided. It wanted us to wear a home kit, but I kind of wanted to wear the away kit. But we're starting with our, with our main team, plus Fedorachenko at left cam, um, Dexter Daniels at right cam, and Rana in for Al Mahal at center back. Because all those three players were extremely tired. And I decided to give them a break. Of course they do. Why doesn't my center backs cover over? And when they do, they just double um, side each other. They don't make any sense. Oh, Mark Town. Finishes. Makes it one to one. I hit my mic right there, but that was a very good play. Because usually that defense is really compact, but I don't know why the side back decided to move a little bit to the side. And Mark Town decided to make a run so right there. So wide open on goal. Um, he doesn't have great finishing, but I don't. I trust Mock Tem in those situations. I could have sweated across, but literally zero point to do that when I trust Mock Tem. Good finish, good pass, all around good team goal. Let's try to get more of these now. 
Get that out. Get that out. He had the ball. He got shielded it, and he just let the defender get around him. I cannot explain how awful that was. Usually, my defense plays is despicable, but not that bad, especially in a close game. Mark Tam shoot that, and it's a block for a corner. That's a that's oh yeah, it's an abominable long, and that play short actually. That's gonna be that. All right, that's gonna be halftime. I don't know, ref, a little sketchy, but yeah, halftime comes. We're not playing bad at all. What is having teams just making bad mistakes? So this stops the team from making bad mistakes and taking out the player that plays that are making mistakes. I switched the team out all around a lot. So Ababanaz now came in at Cam. Um, right here, Sally came at left center back, and somehow Fana Lua and Zhao made their way to playing CDMs. So, make I don't know how to explain what happened when I was making changes. Wait, wait. Okay, of course we get scored on a corner. I have to say something about the player who got subbed out. That's fucked up. And they score again? How's that even my fault? My defender was in the way, and he just turned and lashed one into the back of the net. He, I couldn't have been any more in the way. Somebody, literally anybody, come back into the box. Cam, CDM. But nobody won. They score again. How the fuck did we give the ball away there? My team is turning into absolute dog shit after the first half. But this happens every game. Okay. Are you fucking kidding me? If my CDMs just dropped back, we'd be a much better team. Ow, ow. They should have scored again, honestly. Touch that Dexter. I just run with it. You don't even run with it. That is game. It is what it is. We end up losing 6-1. to one, And it was... Deserved because my team played absolutely atrocious in the second half. Let's look at the ratings. I don't do this anymore, but let's look at them. Like, this tells you all you need to know. I'm gonna play like shit. I'm a Doka. Get that 6.3 um, up the screen. And I guess Zhu gets mad at the match simply because he's the only one who didn't play like shit. Um, I don't know what to say. I guess we will play the next match, but that new goalkeeper is gonna get a run out now. All right, so it's simulating it's Mansfield, the main team, and we win two to one with Amadolka scoring a brace. Very good stuff. Looks like everyone played good except for Dexter Daniels. I'm seeing a trend with him playing pretty bad, but Ju played exceptional. Very good stuff. We're also gonna simulate this game against Port Vale because I don't want to play in Port Vale. We lose three to one. Doesn't matter. Papa John's trophy against Shrewsbury. I'm gonna go ahead and simulate this match. We get a, why do we get a two one win in the um Papa John's trophy? I couldn't care less. Alright, new scouting reports. Eh. Is it gonna be this guy? Or this guy? We'll get Dykes in. I accidentally signed a second player. This is not France, I swear. Look at this guy. Yeah, everyone else doesn't look very good. And we only get one no matter what. And then Bangladesh. Yeah, I guess we have to sign him. No one else overall even looks better than his. So let's go look at get to the next game now. So I accidentally signed a second player. All right, so we got a game against Oldham Athletic now. And as you can see, Dykeson, I don't know if I showed it, but I got another report with a Greenland striker, is starting, and the new keeper is starting too. So let's see how they do. Okay, so they're really pressing us right now. And they get a chance. And they score. 
first shot of the game with down 1-0. I don't know, man. Oh, that's another good save. Sally kind of let them get in, though. Another good save. Where's either of my center backs? Like, honestly, that fell dead center of the box, and there's nobody within a five meter radius for our team. Pick another touch. He just couldn't get open. Now touch. Boom. Bomb and hit that. Handball. Off he looked like a handball. Hit that final lower. Oh, how did that fall? Oh my god. We've had the chances to get one. We just couldn't though. So I'm gonna make changes and hopefully you can get back to this game because defense, like usual, playing awful. And they score. My, I mean, my defense was in position, then they decided to just not to be. So I don't know. We pass out of bounds. No, play defense. What's he uh, Oh, oh! What's he uh, scores the best goal of the series so far. We've had zero good shots. We've had one good shot inside the box. And I've just been taking long shots because I can't get in the box. And look what that leads to. Tedeschi just lays it off for him, takes a touch, boom, it smacks one long, top bins. That was crazy. Let's look at this. I was kind of thinking about taking him out of the starting 11, but after scoring a banger like that, no shot. That's beautiful. Oh, header. Oh, Matiwa. Dude, just put that on target. We're right back in this. Come out, come out. Oh, good stuff. Just run. Nowhere to go. That's a yellow, at least. Just drop one in the box, I guess. No, you drop one and Eh. Might have done something with that, but it doesn't matter. End up losing 3-1. to one. Not bad, not bad. But the rating is what matters. See what Siwa did good. He did out outstanding. He used to upgrade for this match. He did great. All right, so we're going to simulate this game against Gunthorpe with the team that's highest overall-wise because I think we can get a snatch a win out of this, and we do. Two to zero. Very good stuff. Um, so now we have seven points this season, and I've got zero myself. It's very fun. i got to simulate a game against four screen rovers, and I put Bauman at right back, like his old position, and Daniels in at left camp. And that's about it. Oh, and Amadoka at striker. Just, you know, rotating a little bit, making sure everyone gets their game time. We win 1 0. Final Lua makes it 1 0. We might do good, might even fight for promotion. And I'm not the reason why, which is really sad. All right, as you can see, Dykes in a striker, Moretti at left cam, and Sally at left back, and Gedimatos at goalkeeper. Just making sure everybody gets game time. And we lose 2 to 1. But it's all right. Because stuff like that happens. It's like, at least it was a close game. Uh oh. And they score. You have to be kidding me. There was no way I should have given the ball up there. Not such an easy save for my keeper. And he finally makes his first mistake. I'll play a Babana in. Cross it back post. Yes! Matiwa scores once again. Makes it 1-1. One one. And in the last two games, he is the only player to score. Which is really interesting. Because I was thinking about dropping for the team. And now he's scoring on the regular, it looks like. Good header. Only if he could have done that last match, though. You have to get back in time. You don't. You make it two to one. Is my defense that just always falls apart on top of each other for no reason. Head that out. 
out of there. That should be halftime. All right. Went to the break, losing 2-1. to one. When really, it should be 2-2. Two two. Matiwa missed a golden chance. But it is what it is. I really think we have a chance of still winning this, so let's make a couple changes and get back in it. So Hughes and Bauman come in as the only substitutions, and I think we got this. If Hughes has a decent game, we're chilling. No. <gasps> no. They missed. Oh my god. That challenge was stupid anyways. I can't believe um the ref would call that though. They gave advantage for the shot and he missed. That should just be that. That's a short. I'm a hell. No. Oh head that down. Well good stuff. It is that Matiwa again? No, it's final lower. Right. It is, no, it is Matiwa. Good stuff. He makes he makes it three goals in two games. And the only person to score this month from me. Look, I thought I was done, but Almahal won the header and Matiwa puts in a good finish. That's good stuff. He's just been in the right place this game. That defender just didn't even want to defend. He just had his hand up. Let's go get another one get this game. And they score again. I've been playing good defense. The thing is, they just long ball, and my team doesn't know how to fucking handle that. Play him through. Oh, Babana. He has the space. I think he has the beating on his mans. And of course, their keeper saves it. Off for a corner. What can we do with this corner? To Mafuta's head. Mafuta, first goal. Let's go. Get the ball, get the ball. You want another one? Yeah, we really want another one to get back in this game and tie it. Go. I think this is all we have. Hughes, you should have been on your last, the last man. Of course. We end up losing 4-3. to three. I mean, it was a closer game, but we, we should have had the... Um, a tie at least. I think it was a hat trick. The defense is just fucking atrocious. Legendary, world club. Even I, if I go down the professional, I'm probably still going to concede five. It's just how the game is. Now, it doesn't really matter what um team you have. The defense is always going to play like ass. And I'm going to have to find out new tactics. Alright, so how's the team looking? Starting 11. Bench. Like this. And here's the reserves. So. Players getting update grades up. Ayadama, for score, only player to score in the first match. Mark time in the second match because he was also the only player to score. But he did do better, so... I mean, he was the best player on the team, even if he didn't score, so... Third game, going to Peterson. Peterson did really good. Fourth game, Watsuawa. He did extremely good scoring twice. Play of the episode, Watawa. Watsuawa. Watsuawa. I don't know. I'm about to figure that out eventually. Goes to him. Because he did very good in those last two games. And so I'm going to buy three goals in two games. Doesn't go to him. Let's go do the upgrades real quick. I'm probably going to give him, 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 and him a little bit more than they should. But we'll see. Alright, so now that we look at the team. Everybody got the upgrade. Latoua upgraded his, I think, shooting and defending. A little bit of his passing too. Mark time got it. Is shooting really boosted, passing really boosted, and defending really boosted? Somehow he only went up two overalls, which is crazy. And then Patterson just boosted his everything and got reactions up from a 55 to a 63. And then Ayadama went up a 48 to a 50. And boosted his finishing and his heading accuracy, and that's literally all I can boost. So that's to do for the episode. Thank you guys for watching. Please like subscribe. Catch you guys later. Peace.